What's good, YouTube? It's Dom. I'm about to show y'all my journey to becoming a GOAT in College Football 25, Road to Glory. Alright, so off the rip. Started off with the improviser quarterback, and I went 6'5", 245. That is a mistake. I will never make that shit again. Um, went to choose schools. Uh, kind of just went to the one at the top and just took it. Don't go to Northwestern. Don't be like me. This shit was also a mistake. And you will see why shortly. But yeah, you know, we committed four stars. Played our first little practice drill. You know, did the option attack, uh, handed the ball off. And he didn't get very much yardage. Um, tried it again, right? Handed the ball off to him again. And he runs right into a, a wall. So, yeah, it's a good sign. Uh, got in our first huddle. You know, coach drew up the, uh, the very common run play that he likes to draw up. So, uh, you know, snap the ball to the running back, right? And he does the same shit he was doing in practice and gets tackled two yards off the fucking line of scrimmage. The next play, we come out, pass play, get lined up. Kind of seeing something here. Snap the wall. Have try and go across the middle, hit him, and he turns it up for 10 yards. Now, before I snap this ball, I just want you to look at how many people are in this fucking box. Don't matter, though. I'm still a laser beam. That's a tough catch, too. Coach draws up a five-yard play for some reason. Uh, circle burned his man off the line and was gone, so I just slung it down there. That's a wide-open touchdown for free. They just handed that one to us. Now, remember when I said don't go to Northwestern? Yeah, this is right here. Why? This, this is it. Every single time, your offensive line is getting pushed around. And you're being forced to make 70-yard passes or throwing out of sacks to just to try to get an open man. Once again, we've got a receiver burning his man. And I just lofted it down there to him. Somehow, even through all of that, we still get our ass beat by three fucking points. This is the story of the whole first season. Now we snap this ball on the next game and my offensive lineman is getting turned around like he's the defensive lineman, so I have to take that shit off. Once again, I could have hit triangle, but by the time I would have thrown that ball, my defensive lineman, offensive lineman, would have gotten me in trouble, so I just took it to the house. Once again, my defense can't stop anybody, even the worst teams in the league, so we lose. I literally can't even blame this one on the offensive line. They just sent every fucking person on their team to come hit the quarterback. Doesn't matter, I got the arm. Once again, my offensive line is getting turned around in circles, so I have to turn this one out around, use my speed to my advantage, and cut it up the field. Also, just want to point out how empty this damn stadium is. Look at that shit, bro. We finally won a game, and this shit was... Not even close, but of course it was an FCS team, so I don't know if that really counts, but. Cut our team celebration in, and then it was finally time to change the team. Ended up going a uh, five-star team. I didn't want to start off the rip, so I went with Ohio State and took that chance. The moment I arrived here, I instantly got thrown into a quarterback battle. Knocking down these little targets was not a issue. Won that battle and got up to QB2, which they told me I was going to be at anyway, so that was weird. And then a couple games later, I got moved into the second quarterback battle to make this absolute laser beam between two defenders. Win that quarterback battle, and now I'm number one. Off the rip, 
snap the ball and there's already the entire team running at me so I roll out the right and hit this cross he catches it and then uh, you know six points next time down come through snap the ball this little route here gets open he makes a clean move and then another six huge difference in the uh, you know packed house here compared to the like five people we had in the stadium at the other one this drive down we go through this little weird post route that he was not supposed to run opens up and he takes that one to the house as well he was most definitely supposed to run like a weird like cross and that shit did not go the way he was supposed to run it but oh well we win that one as a much easier 38 to 27 and that'll be the uh, first win of many Right after that, when this game decides to do the funniest shit ever and tell me that I can go out and it won't affect my play, and then two seconds later tell me that it will affect my play. <laughs> so uh, yeah, minus 15 stamina for next week's game because I got home at 3 a.m. I then had to pull out the slow-mo replay on this one because this fucking pass was ridiculous. Throw out of the sack. Split the first defender right behind the second one and before the third one can get there, hit him in his hands and this dumbass drops the ball. But, you know, that's a ball one, so we'll take it. And right after the first one, we won another one. And it's really not even close. 72 to 35 is actually fucking crazy. Then, uh, yeah. Come out and it's time for the national championship game. Walkout's fire, and just like how fire this walkout is, my channel's fire, so you should like, subscribe, and follow me for more. Now I had to cut out the entire first quarter, because that shit was brutal, um, but this is the first play I feel like where we got somewhat of a positive yardage, and that was a crazy play of my receiver. Uh, just don't look at the score. 17-0 um, to zero in the first quarter is kind of ridiculous. March it down in the second quarter. Hit a cross into the end zone. Get this ridiculous call. You can't tell me looking at both of his feet right as he catches his fucking ball that he's not inbounds. And even if one of his feet are out, the other one is clearly still in, so it's still a catch, but you know, college football, I guess. Take this one in by myself. Line this one up have to come out with fucking hot routes because they take audibles out the game and make you have to sit here and draw up the play as the coach and the player. Send one of them on a slant. The other one's got a wide open down the field pass because he just absolutely burns this guy. He makes an incredible play on the ball and that's a wide open touchdown. This next play, I was yelling at my coach for calling this fucking jet sweep over and over, but I guess, you know, when you put it in the right person's hands, it actually turns into a fucking touchdown. Now, to take the lead after being down 17-0 in the first quarter, we line it up, hit us with some crossers. Another incredible ma move by the receiver for six. And then that was the end of the game, and we are national champions. Winning the game 69 to 41 after being down 17 0 is crazy, by the way. I literally didn't score in the first quarter and still pulled out 70 points. And uh, yeah. This guy holding up a trophy right here has cost me many fucking sacks. At the end of the day, that's the end of the sophomore season. We've got a ring, but I'm still missing the Heisman trophy. And that shit was not going to be a fucking walk in the park when my offensive lineman is literally letting people hit me for free. No, we had to flick up on this fucking trash ass team Northwestern. I don't even know why anybody would go there. Finally, by the end of the season, I had my first Heisman trophy. You know what's also fucking crazy is my running back is uh, 
fifth. <laughs> we won a couple uh Big Ten Championship, Orange Bowl, and then I think, yep, the Rose Bowl. And then once again, it was coming up on the second championship. Line up for our first play. Get my wide receiver in motion and catch my running back on the outside, wide open. Touchdown on the first drive. My coach loves this damn play for some reason, so we gonna run this shit. Open it up, got the tight end across the middle, that's another six. Then look at this cheat code ass middle linebacker they had. Bro got 96 speed as a middle linebacker. Hit this little slant on the cross. It's another easy six. And then I catch my speedster wide receiver down the middle. He gets flipped over like a little kid. And then we score six. And then we get the same run out animation as the last one, but hey, we'll take it. It's another championship. Count it up. Now at the end of my junior year, I have my choice. Do I leave for the NFL? Or do I continue on? And we continue on. Job ain't finished just yet. I had to come back and look at my roster to see who all they left. I kept my running back and lost my receivers. And this bitch Audrey trying to get me in trouble again, so, you know. Freeze the RA, fuck it. That was me until this result happened. Shit was a terrible fucking choice, because, uh... RA does not watch football. Our uh, senior year was uh, summed up by this play right here. Hand the ball off. And watch my running back run or PA into a pass because there was no other fucking options all season long. That or this, well, I guess, you know, the read option where I'm mushing little babies off of me and shit, but yeah, run game all season. Had a little sit back and watch all of the trophies I got at the end of the senior year. Got the player of the year. Got my second Heisman, the first to do that shit in 50 years. Got the Jonathan, whatever, golden arm shit, and the best quarterback. We won the Rose Bowl right after that. Then we took the Orange Bowl, 20 to 50, uh, 49, and then it was time for another uh, another college football championship. Off the rip, I'm getting hit by the whole damn team. I roll out, break this sack, and throw a dot to the R1 on the side there. Snap this one, and uh, take a risky ass shot down the field, but an elite play made by my uh, weird ass, no name ass wide receiver. I uh, snap this one and drop it off to my running back because he's wide open and uh, get assaulted in the backfield, but I'm just gonna act like that didn't happen. I got a little quick slant off to my wide receiver here. He makes an elite juke that he didn't need to make. Snap this ball once again. I'm getting hounded by 13 people in the backfield. <laughs> Uh, make another pass out of a sack and whip this one across the field he would have got his life laid out but another championship won first person to do that shit in a hundred years and uh, only person other than Archie Griffin in the last 50 years to win two Heisman trophies I think I just solidified myself as the GOAT